The first week of testimony in Chad Daybell's murder trial is going quicker than attorneys expected. He is accused of killing his first wife, Tammy Daybell, and his second wife, Lori Vallow's two kids, Tylee and JJ, who used to live here in the Valley. 12 News I Team journalist Erica Stapleton brings us a recap of the trial's first week. So far, the state's only called one witness, an investigator who's testified for hours, and it's likely the defense will call him again later in the trial. The jury's been sworn in, and each side is pitching their case. Three dead bodies. Prosecutor Rob Wood, using the same phrasing he did to lay out the motivation in the state's case against Chad's wife, Lori Vallow Daybell. Money, power, and sex. Daybell is accused of killing his first wife, Tammy Daybell, and Lori Vallow's two kids, Tylee and JJ. The kids were found buried in Chad Daybell's Idaho backyard, and Tammy died in her family's home. Chad and Lori married less than three weeks after her death. His desire for sex, money, and power led him to pursue those ambitions. And this pursuit led to the deaths of his wife and Lori's two innocent children. But defense attorney John Pryor said Chad had, quote, no remarkable background and that things only changed when he met Lori, who was convicted in this case last year and sentenced to life in prison. And then Lori Vallow comes in the picture, Miss Texas, with her testimony about this beautiful, vivacious woman, very sexual person, and very manipulative. And she knows how to get what she wants. Laying the foundation to blame Lori and her brother, Alex Cox. Cox is listed as a co-conspirator, but he can't be charged in this case because he died in Arizona in December 2019, apparently of natural causes. Oh, Cox no. also coming up a lot in testimony from the state's first witness, you. Idaho well, detective sorry. Ray Hermosillo who also testified at Lori's trial. He's one of the first investigators involved in this case, and he testified for hours about how it turned into a search for the kids and discovering their bodies in Daybell's backyard. He was also questioned by the defense about other attempted killings connected to this case, trying to take attention off Chad. Who do you believe killed Charles Allen? Alex Cox, okay. Who do you believe took the shot at Brandon Boudreaux? Alex Cox. The court took a break Friday, and testimony is set to continue Monday morning. Erica Stapleton, 12 News.